everyone, it's Willers, and I think it's finally about time we follow up the boot camp series, and we're going to do that with the map Woods. Just like last time, we're going to start with the spawns, so read the annotations at the bottom of the screen for the spawn location. Also take note the footage may not be in the exact place inch by inch, but that's because I actually walked all the spawn locations, but it's going to be pretty damn close. Now that you've figured out where you've spawned, I'm sure you're wondering, well, where do I go now? Well, on Woods, there's a couple places of interest, and you have the choice to go to a bunker, a plane, or the lumber mill, or a shack full of scopes. And I guess the decision's up to you. But this being a tutorial video, I probably should show you all of these places. So why don't we go ahead and do that? So we're gonna start with my favorite then which has to be the airplane crash in the middle of a forest. So if you look at the map right now, I wanna bring it up here. It's directly north of the break in the wall spawn. So all you have to do is head out the hole in the wall and go straight on. You're gonna hit the tail of the plane. Now, the plane doesn't really have any great loot around it, but it's a good meeting ground for you and your buddies. Next, I'm gonna cover the bunkers. And I'm only going to show you one bunker, which is going to be the one closest to the spawn, just because I feel like if I showed you both, it's kind of kind of kill off the discovery of the map. It's not going to be as, as exciting. But anyways, the first bunker is basically right in front of the mid spawn. So all you have to do is go out of the mid spawn, walk straight north. You're going to bump into uh, a bunch of foliage and then look at your feet. You might see a hole in the ground, then you know you're there. Alright, moving on to the scope shack. So you need to find your way to the lumber mill. Now, I'm not going to show you how to get to the lumber mill because I feel like that takes away from the fun. But you'll find it, it's a pretty self-explanatory map, it's pretty straightforward, so I don't think you should have a problem. So once you make it there, stand in the same position that I'm in and follow exactly what I do. Well damn, it looks like you finally made it to the scope shack. So now, go find your loot, go take what you want, if you, there's anything good there. And after that, look right across the way and you're going to see a whole cabin full of scavs. You can kill them if you want, but you're pretty much on the home stretch of the map. So you don't really have to. Just take your sweet loot and run away. So now, it's time to leave woods. All you have to do is head down the road straight from the cabin and you should be good to go. Stick in this general area of the map and you should have an extraction zone timer. So, I didn't really want to go too in-depth when making this video, I just felt like that kind of ruins the fun a little bit, but this is going to give a better idea for new players of kind of where you spawn and how things work on woods and what directions to head. Woods is a pretty self-explanatory map, it's kind of like it's a road that leads you to the extraction and this is the only extraction point. I don't own the maps that you guys saw, so I'm going to put a downloadable link in the description, but anyways, thanks guys, see you next time.